2022. So we've got a new website from Evergrow Coin, and I just want to say before I get into this, you know, it's th this is more like it. You know, this is in line with what Evergrow Coin really is. Um, I'll say now that I wasn't really a fan of the original website, not really a fan of the second website. Although I did a video on it saying that it was, you know, miles better. It looked great. It functioned, you know, much better. But this, this is more like it. This represents Evergo Coin, something, you know, that we've needed to be out there in the public space for some time. You know, it's actually a little bit frustrating when you think about what Evergo Coin is building, you know, what they have uh, in the background, what they're going to be producing, what they're going to be releasing, you know, and the professional, um, or, or at least the premium standard of those products and services, knowing that it's there and knowing it's just on the cusp of being released, you know, was becoming a little bit frustrating uh, for me personally, because obviously I talk to a lot of people, you know, and I, I try to say to people, look, just relax, everything's fine, everything's going to come good, just chill, just chill, just chill. Um, and now seeing this website, it's not a small thing. It's very easy to just look at a website and say, eh, it's just a website, right? Where's the NFT marketplace, right? But that's not what this is about. Seeing a functioning website like this um, shows that there's been some time and effort that's gone into this. You know, it, uh, it's, it looks absolutely stunning. It's beautiful. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if anybody's ever used uh, Editor X. I, I believe it's called Editor X of Wix. Um, but you can kind of put some really beautiful websites together. And I know personally, having tried to use, you know, Wix and built websites in the past using Java and C++ and stuff, it's not easy putting a website together. There's a lot of content that goes on there. It does take a little bit of time. Um, I've heard people say so many times, oh, it's just a copy and paste, not of this website, but just in general. It's just a copy and paste. That's easy. I can throw a website together in a few minutes. Yeah, I can. The question is, is it going to be any good? You know, is it going to be functional? Will it work? You know, will it do what it's supposed to do? You know, will it, will it be you know, presentable in terms of professionalism? Does it represent the company? And there's so many things to take into consideration, right? When the website is up and running because that represents you as a company, that represents your brand, that represents your professionalism, that represents your team, that represents your entire organization. So obviously having a website that is in line with everything that you're promising goes a massive, massive long way, you know, to um, instilling that confidence when people come to Evergrow Coin. Obviously we've got Evergrow, Evergrow Coin Man or Evergrow Man here. Um, I'm going to try to stop saying Evergo coin going forward. Uh, I believe that that's not going to be a thing. Um, uh, and to be honest, Evergo is much better. Obviously, again, it's more in line with what they're trying to do. So I'm not going to go through the entire website. I'm just going to flick through as I talk, right? Just to kind of give you guys a little bit of a, you know, a looky see on, on, on how it looks for those that haven't seen it yet. Obviously, you know, if this is your kind of your first introduction to the Evergo, you know, the Ever, um, I was about to say Evergo coin, 